to date, the university with the largest student body in the United States has over 200,000 full-time equivalent students. You will not find those students in academic building covered with ivy leaves. leaves. You will not find them in classrooms taking notes while somebody scribbles on a blackboard. Instead, you will find them hanging out around online lectures, social networks, and digital libraries. The largest university in the United States today is the University of Phoenix online. Traditional universities like Georgetown University in Washington, D.C. are coming online. Our websites are visited by millions of people who watch webcasts of campus speeches by Nobel Peace Prize winner Muhammad Yunus or President Obama. Our lifetime students enroll in online continuing education courses. One, our traditional students participate in conventional lectures, but also sit on web conferences and video conferences, sometimes with students from campuses far away, like those in London and Qatar. Some of our students snowed in in the nation's capital or stranded in Europe due to an Icelandic volcano, listened to class recording, and joined web conferencing lectures. As of today, one in five college students in the United States is taking a course online. To pursue our academic mission, to close the digital divide, and to bring education to all, we dream about an affordable, reliable, pervasive internet that citizens worldwide can access. We dream about student populations with the necessary academic, language, and technology skills to study in a global university campus and to make a contribution to society. We dream about strong privacy and information security framework to protect academic freedom and to fuel academic discourse. An Oxford polymath once said that all that is needed to have a university is a library and a printing press. I would argue that as of today, what is truly needed to have a university is an internet connected and savvy community of faculty, staff, and students. I hope that our work today will bring us closer to those goals.